Hey guys, this is Mario Freak 1989, aka Nintendo Girl for Life, and welcome back to, um, let's replay Twilight Princess part, I don't know, anyways, last time, last time, wait, I had to, I had to make my way all the way down here, that's why you probably noticed my heart's just, like, decreased by a lot. Anyway, so last time we got through most more of the temple and got the double claw shot, so I'm gonna use this to continue on, but that we can be Spider-Man, in other words. This was pretty cool, I like it. Anyway, so we're gonna make our way up. I like this idea. This is a pretty neat idea they did. See, can I reach the thing up there? No, I need to go up. Wait, I can actually reach it. So we have to pull this down. Whatever you do, don't let go, but go down. And grab it. Yeah, we did it, so let's keep going. We're halfway through this temple already. I don't know if I've ever said it in the last part that I haven't uploaded yet, but... I'm, I'm finishing this LP, by the way. By, what I meant by finishing this LP... I'm not gonna collect any more hard pieces because this... this is, is so old that it keeps screwing up from time to time, so... So, I'm just gonna, um, finish up the LP. I'm not even gonna get any more heart pieces. I'm sorry, guys, but th this disc is killing me. It keeps cutting out from time to time, like you guys have been noticing. It's, it's really annoying, and, 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 and I just want to finish the LP before the disc not works anymore, period. So, yeah. I don't know if I said it in the last part. I probably did. Alright. So, this part. Let me see if I can blow them up with my bomb arrows. And I still haven't used that soup since that temple, huh? So let's see if I can blow up these guys up here. Alright, just to make life easier, because I don't want I don't feel like falling. Let's put this in there. Alright. Alright, so let's start climbing. I really like this feature in the game. It's really neat. So we go over here, and then we grab on to this. And we climb up. As Link climb up, I'm about to say, yeah, so that, that's what's gonna happen for the rest of this LP. In other words, when I'm done this, I'm just gonna go straight to the Twilight Palace and just finish it up. Wait, is this the part I'm supposed to? I need to go to the other one, alright. Alright. Love this game, but it's just I have to end it before the disc dies, and I won't be able to finish the LP at all. I would like to finish the LP to nothing at all, to be honest. Uh, let's stop right close to the end of the game. Anyway, so without this, now now we're going back into the room with with uh, Argara, the bo boss of this dungeon, broke the bridge. Now we have to use our claw shot to get across our double claw shot. Starting with that, to that, to that, and lastly that. Fall down and let's go on before those things decide to knock me off the platform or something. Oh, they can't knock me off now, I already made it, but you know. Alright. Since we're back on this end, where we got the, I think either the first key or the map, I can't remember. So we do this, we grab onto that, and we do more. And we drop. Alright. We grab onto, oh, it's too far. It's a little too far, so we gotta move up closer. Grab, grab onto this. I thought I, I thought I had it too, alright. Um... I think grab onto this. Uh, I messed up, didn't I? 
Oh no, I did it. Okay. Go over here. Let's put these here, cause cause I know there's another one here. Where is it? Wait, where is it? Oh my god, I have too much stuff. I don't need any more stuff. Oh, I know what I gotta do. Grab one for that. And now this is the part I was talking about. Up. Kill those two. Do this. Hit this crystal. This is this is this is the coolest gimmick ever in, in, in the dungeon. Come down some more. It's kind of scary how you suspend it in the air, use uh, relying on a claw shot. I don't know. I find it scary and awesome at the same time, to be honest. All right, so we grab onto this up here. We drop. I believe there's a chest on the. Yeah, there is. With a purple. Oh god, I'm dead. I'm dead. Maybe not. So every. I think I think, I think I've told you what the purple sludge does. It. It could be either good or bad when you drink it. Got some bombs, which we need. All right. Uh, it's another chest, but I have no idea where that chest is. I'm gonna scoot past this guy because I really don't want to deal with them. Go through this door. Go through this door and no, not the boots. No. Since we have bomb arrows, it's easier to kill this guy. And if you remember from the first dungeon, they brought back a gimmick that we have to do, which is this gimmick. Oh my god, get it off! And that's the f this gimmick they brought back from the first dungeon. It's just to get it, it's just to get him out the way, though. So there we go. No key under him this time. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Anyone else? Alright. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do at all. I kinda like the idea of Skyward Sword, how you can get, um, re get back, put bombs back in your bag. I wish I could have brought that gimmick back in this game, but then again, they never thought of it probably to probably after this after Skyward Sword. I don't know. Okay, this part I'm gonna hate is you have to be quick. Get it? There we go. Go up top here. I believe is a chest you can get. Oh my! Oh, if you would have got me, I would have really lost it right there. He has a chest right there. We can get that. Oh, money, thanks. Oh, man. So... More of the weird. Oh God, go away! So we have to get on this and start like using this to climb along. I remember using this also in Wind Waker, the first dungeon. So yeah, up, 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 up. More arrows, thanks, game. 
Come on, let's grab onto the edge. Don't knock me down. Don't knock me down. I should have blew him up first. Oh, God! Damn it! Be right back. Alright, we're back. And, like I said before, get rid of him. Actually, I think I could just walk along this. Yeah, I could have made life easier by just walking along that. So, before we do that, I believe the chest across this. Oh god, please don't knock me down. Please don't knock me down. Just keep missing. And get this chest here. Another piece of heart. Sweet. Oh my god, he's eating my head! That was weird. That was a weird glitch. He was acting like he was stuck in something. That was kind of weird. So let's get back up here and go back across. There's one more chest, but I don't know where the hell that's at. Anyway, so it's about 13 minutes in. So... I thought I grabbed that. Oh shoot, I'm dead. I'm dead! Fuck! I do all that shit again. Damn it. Ugh, be right back. Now we're back. Uh, get up here this time. Oh my god. So let's just grab this and go down. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Jeez. Hold on, I'm scratching my head. Alright, let's go on. No, wait, this chest here was probably money, which, you know what, we're not gonna need anymore, since I'm just gonna try to finish up the game. We're 15 minutes in, alright. Now, uh, this part. Wait, there's two chests in here. That's. Okay, it's not in there. There's a chest in here. Okay, so it's not here. Alright. So grab onto this. I'm sorry, but I don't know what the hell these things are. Are they supposed to be like pea hats? Like really, really re weird pea hats? If they are, Jesus Christ, they're weird. So wait for the second P hack. P hat. I believe there's a chest in this section here, but you know, I'm not gonna bother. He is gonna go back, right? Oh shit! No, 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 no. Okay, good. So 
So I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna drop. Oh god! So let's see. Uh, let's see. wait. Oh god, wait. Damn it, I screwed up, didn't I? Oh, can I grab it from here? I can't. It was that pea hat. Where is the pea hat? Where is it? What the hell am I targeting? Oh, that's something down there. Alright, I want to get over there. Let's get back on this pea hat. And let's fight another ghost. Come on. Ay! Just, just give me the damn pulse. Alright, there's a chest around here. Where is it? There it is. And this is... Oh wow, money. Alright. So let's grab the pea hat and get the hell... Oh wow, that's not what I wanted to do at all. And let's wait for it to come back. Get her back over there. Alright, we're well, over here. Now, what are we supposed to do over here? Is there a door or something? Uh, what was the point of coming over here? Uh, wow, I don't remember. Oh, wait, I remember. I don't wait for it to come back because I need to make a trip through these holes. At this part, I hate it so much. As you wait, oh wait, there it is. You have to like go through these holes. Like, this part always annoys me because I don't know how far down you have to be to fit through. So let's hope that it doesn't like knock me off because I hate this part so much. Okay, come on. All right. Now this one annoy me the most. You gotta make sure you're down enough to touch to go through the hole, but at the same time not enough to touch the um, not to touch the end of the what's in there. I hate this part. Come on. All right. Oh, glitchy. That was weird. So when the. There's actually a, a chest down here, but you know, it's probably rupee, so I'm not gonna get it. Alright, so now. Is there two doors here? There was only one. Actually, I remember how to get that other chest. Alright. It's a hard piece in the other chest that I know how to get. I remember how to get. Anyways. Alright. Next room. Wow, we're 20 minutes. I guess after this hard piece, we'll. Oh God! No, please don't. So we go around in a circle. And we go through this door. And that chest I mentioned before, here we go. It's, a, it's a, um. And we got another heart container. Alright. That was enough to get another heart container, which is good. I'm about to end up this part. That means when I come back the next time, I have to work my way back all the way up here. 
And you know what? I'm just gonna end it here. Until next time, this is Mario Freak 1989 aka Nintendo Girl for Life, and see you in the next part. I said see you in the next part!